Hello, I am Ben. This is a £35 running shoe. Is it any good? This is the Kalenji Jogflow 500.1. It is a £35 running shoe from Decathlon. It features a 4 mil drop, claimed weight of 200 grams. This is a UK 12, which is more like 300. Smaller sizes will be lighter. And it is a shoe that Decathlon claimed to be for every single person and even prevent injury on the injury prevention. No shoe can prevent injury. It is on you as a runner to make your body beautiful and strong for the wonderful art of running. Yet, Decathlon did team up with the Luxembourg Institute of Health to perform a study which concluded that a softer foam amongst 800 or so leisure runners resulted in less injuries. So that is why this shoe features a softer foam in the midsole. With the shoe on and running, you can feel that softness. It's a very cushioned shoe, it's very flexible, it's lightweight, it feels quite plush. It's quite reminiscent of a Nike Free, if you can remember those. The foam isn't the most responsive. I don't want to say the words energy return, but the energy return isn't probably up there, but it doesn't really matter. You're naturally inclined to run a bit faster in it. You're biomechanically going to want to run a little bit more efficiently with the four mil drop because it's a slightly flatter shoe. And it just feels very comfortable on foot. The laces do up nicely. There's no hot spots on the top of the foot. It delivers in all the areas that you'd expect a more expensive shoe. We've had this shoe in for a while now. It has outperformed our expectations. It is a perfect shoe for anyone who is a leisure runner, recreational runner, anyone who likes to do 5K at the weekend, or simply someone who wants a cushioned, lightweight, nimble feeling running shoe that doesn't break the bank. An extra plus to all of this is that Kalenji have signed themselves up to Eco Design, which means that they've had to incorporate ecologically sound practices in the building of this shoe, which means that the insole and the upper feature a recycled material, which is an extra bonus really for £35, just to know that in this sort of disposable world of running shoes, these have at least attempted to offset a little bit of the production process. To conclude, this is a £35 running shoe. In the day and age where running shoes can hit nearly £300, £35 is an absolute bargain. What you get for your money is a lightweight, nimble feeling, comfortable running shoe. Should it be at the top of your list? Maybe. It won't be for everyone. 4mm is quite a flat feeling shoe. If you're more accustomed to a 10mm drop then you will notice it, but that's not a bad thing. So, affordability, tick. Comfort, tick. Longevity, TBC. Injury prevention, not really a thing. This is a very competent running shoe for £35. Get it if you want one.